what's going on guys? Um, I'm going to start posting videos again now that I have recovered from um, uh, Technoblade's death. But, yes, as I just said there, <clears throat> you all know the fallen YouTube star who was a very popular Minecraft sensation um, for most of us. Awesome. As you all know, he passed away last month, and um, <laughs> I just wanted to pay tribute to him, so I built a monument. What you can see right now is a diamond sword. Okay. It's actually a giant diamond sword that I built, and uh, underneath it, as you can see there, is Techno's crown. And yes, Technoblade is at the bottom of my screen. But <clears throat> that is the diamond sword inside of Technoblade's crown. His <sighs> and yes. Technoblade never dies. I built this. So, I, the Technoblade Never Dies part, that I made out of, <clears throat> that part I built out of, um, blocks of netherite. And then got the diamond sword going into the crown. And basically, the way I got the crown to be square like it is and the size it is, is I used two TNT blocks. <clears throat> I used one TNT block to get rid of a l some of the dirt, and then I used another one on the bedrock to get rid of the other dirt, the rest of the dirt, to make that giant square. And I did some adjustments too. Now, up to the very first layer, um, very outer layer. And that's how I got the crown there, and then I refilled it. Now this diamond sword doesn't actually have a tip to it, I just made it flat right here at the bottom, just so it looks like it's going into the dirt. As you can see here from a more zoomed out view, it looks like it's actually going in the dirt, even though it's, it doesn't have a tip to it, it's just flat right there. And for the hand, handle, this is actually interesting because a lot of swords in real life, they have like a rope look, they have like a rope looking thing around the handle so I thought ladders would be perfect for this and the ladders give it a bit of a rope type texture and then I put a this up here the diamond blocks up here for the top of the sword actually if I get out a diamond sword then hold on, this might be easier if I drop the sword Okay, so let's, when I get down here, then yeah, you can see right here at the bottom of the sword, it has like a... Right there, at the top of the handle. It's got a blue part, blue diamondy part. So that's basically what I did with this one. And uh, yeah. That's what I did from the diamond sword. Get rid of this. But yes, Technoblade never dies. Sorry about the animals down there, they just spawn. You can't control that. At least I'm, I might be able to, but I don't... just haven't found that out. But yeah. Um, this is my Technoblade monument. Farewell to Technoblade. You will have it for, be forever in our hearts. And remember, Technoblade never dies. I will leave you with this one image. And that is it for this video. Spring Bonnie, out.